Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today I'm going to be filming for you guys an unboxing of March's BoxyCharm. I've been a member with BoxyCharm since, I can say when, since they started. I've been with them for quite a while. Um, I watched them evolve, I watched them change the boxes, and yeah, it's been a company that I've seen grow and I have grown with as well. Um, my makeup collection basically started out with BoxyCharm. Um, I went from having a little bit of makeup and not so great makeup because sometimes they did not have the best products, but at the end of the day, it was makeup and it showed me how to do makeup throughout the years. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna keep it short and yeah, so let's do the unboxing for March. Oh yeah, so now what I'm gonna go ahead and start doing is recording every month's boxy charm. I also have other subscriptions, but this is going to be one of the main ones that I'm gonna make sure I follow up and go and pull through every month to show you guys what I received. So this month, the boxes, you know, design is creepy cute. As you can see here, I love that they changed the card. They always had them like this. They always listed what was in the box. Um, so, yeah, the first thing I got was the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I actually use this in all of my videos. This is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite primers. So I'm happy to have another one. Um, this retails for about $16 and this box only costs $21 so remember that um, then I got we can say a real her lady love matte liquid lipstick um, I haven't opened it yet so we're gonna open it now uh, this one ranges for about $15 I got the in the shade I am a rock star. This is how the packaging looks. And then I am a rock star. I think I did it upside down, right? Most likely. I love this packaging. This packaging is beautiful. And then it has real hair on the top. See if the camera focus. Yep. And it's actually a really pretty color. I'm going to swatch it. Swatch it while we're on camera. So this is actually a really, really pretty color. I would definitely wear this color. So this is so me. Um, the next product we got, they also included a view her expert advanced lip liner i got the shade i am loved this one retails for 12.50 i'm gonna link the website below as well if you like the items you can definitely go shop the website so this is the box And let me open it up. This is how the liner looks. It says, I am loved. Inspirational products. So this is how, this is the pencil, how it looks. And I'm gonna swatch it up here. And it's a perfect eyeliner for the lipstick. So see? matches so that's actually great can't wait to use this then another item we received was the deluxe fan brush ss023 by Crown brush it retails for $18.99 so it says this fan brush features a large fan brush head Perfect for the soft application of powder products. This brush is also great for lightly dusting shimmer products onto the skin. And then it says boxy tip. 
Gently dip brush across your favorite highlight or powder and dust across your cheekbone for beautiful glowy effect. Brush can also be used to buff out powders and bronzers. So yeah. I had one from Coastal Scents from ooh, years ago. And then I think I received one from BoxyCharm back there. Um, before, but definitely, definitely a good one. Wait, it wasn't BoxyCharm. I lied. It was from Morphe. Morphe um, Me subscription. I also have that subscription as well. They sent fan brushes. So, can't wait. It says Jumbo Kabuki Fan. Can't wait to use it. I've seen people use it for high um for contour, so I can't wait to try it out with the contour. So let's see how that plays out. And then the last thing I received is a Naked Cosmetics palette. It says it's the Urban Rustic palette. It retails for $39.99. This is the packaging. Let me go ahead and open it up. Oh my god, I always break these boxes. Okay. This is the compact. That's how it comes in. And then you open it up. And bring, of course, the little slide to protect it. And then these are the colors. I'm gonna swatch them on me because I know I've seen a lot of swatches on the internet but it's never the same on everyone so let me go ahead and swatch some They're actually really pigmented this is a different duo color that I'll be used to um, in a palette it's really weird but vibrant colors I wouldn't mind using it and testing it out but it's very pigmented the texture of it is creamy I really like it actually good this is the swatches my swatches suck but yeah I like the colors it has I don't know the color names it doesn't have what the color names are that would have actually been really cool to have but it oh it says a green bronze purple and Oh, the colors have, let's see. Oops. So it says, these colors offer a dramatic look when applied damp or with an eye base. The color has, the colors have hints of green, bronze, and purple and brown. And then it says, apply boxy tip, apply shadow to your lids to give your eyes a beautiful pigmented shimmer. For more pigment, lightly wet your brush for an even more intense, I guess, look. So that'll be really really cool to try i always use a like a primer or a spray to put like makeup on my lids so it can be more vibrant more pigmented and be more bold but yeah um i give this boxy charm a thumbs up it came with five products all full size except the uh, smashbox um, photo finish primer but i have mine for a while and it's lasting me so a little little one like this travel size goes a long way so don't be fooled um so yeah i'm very happy with my boxy charm this month can't wait to try more um it'll be really good to see what there is more to offer with boxy charm and how much more how much how many more companies they'll be affiliated with and putting their products in their boxes so yeah um it was a quick tutorial but a good boxy charm and can't wait to see what it has to offer in the future so yeah thank you so much for watching and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe um and also give it a thumbs up if you like the video thumbs down it's okay and also last but not least make sure you leave your comments i love to hear feedback as i stated in all my other videos i love love feedback and let me know what you want to see in the future um i'm also going to try to do more tutorials i'm trying to do two a week um but due to work my daughter personal life etc it does become a little bit hard and difficult but yeah i just came from work um 
I was like, let me film the boxy charm before my daughter and everyone else comes over. It's Friday night, so we're gonna have some wine and just chill out. But yeah, um, thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Yeah.